A 1 0 victory over second place Stockton Town. Um, it was uh, The game was on a knife edge for, for a long time, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah. I think I think first half, I don't think we were great. Uh, I think both sides really, first half, I think a lot of, being a lot of neutrals come today. I think they'll probably come and see a, <coughs> a bomb at table clash, really. I don't think they much quality in the first half. I think um, the message to us at half time was, you know, take the handbrake off, let's go and have a go. Let's go and have a go. And I think second half, I think we did that. I think we put on a good performance second half. Uh, and obviously a will did to, to win the game. It was a it was a real cat and mouse game, wasn't it? But, you know, sort of you say about the quality, but you could argue that two quality sides sort of cancelled themselves out. Yeah, definitely. They they they're a very good side. I, I put it on record every time about you know I, I like the way they play. I like the way they operate, and they've got some good players in there. Uh, but I think probably the first half, I think both sides probably not meaningly. I don't know, obviously, you know out there. I just I don't know their team talk, but for my team talk, I want to go and have a go, have, have a go at them. Uh, we've got points on the board, so let's 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 go and see how many we can score. But I, I don't think we did that, and I don't think uh, I don't think Stockton did either. I think we, like I said, gave a little bit a little bit res too much respect for each other and, and, and tried to wait for uh, the opposition to to make a mistake rather than going and actually earning earning the goal. Uh, but second half, I think we did that. I think we 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 went for we went for the game, went for for the. Uh, Went for a juggler really, and uh, I think it was a well deserved win in the end. Do you think maybe having the, the 14 days off maybe contributed to that in terms of like um, footballing sharpness? No, no, I, I don't have anything to do with sharpness today. I felt they looked fit, sharp, and healthy. Uh, I, I just think, like I said for staff, it, it, was, it was a very cagey game. I don't think I think we were both trying to feel each other out, and, uh, and and no, I don't think I don't think the Beck had, had any. Any influence on on the game whatsoever, and again, we're against a very good side, a very good side with some very good players in there. So it's not easy. It's not easy at all. If you say that the game lacks quality, we certainly got that that quality with Hughes's finish. Uh, how pleased are you with him to sort of? Because when you miss a penalty in, in a game, it could it could really be a, a big mental battle. But he managed to squash that pretty quickly. Yeah, listen, he's been unbelievable for us this season, and he's got that in the lock of the world. The other goal, uh, well, great finish. I must mention Luke Hall because you know when he came on, I thought he was unplayable. He he, uh, he 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 created the penalty, he created the goal, uh, and I felt sorry for him in the end because he's he's through one on one at the end and referee blows. But going back to Uzi, I don't think uh, what will be one bit. You know he's he's a, he's a, he's very strong mentally, uh, unbelievable human being, and you know penalty missed. So what he does he send? I had, I had no problems with him dusting his send down and. Pony said in the right areas to take the next chance, which he ultimately did. You were going to mention Luke Hall, um, just how much of a nuisance is he see today? I thought you were frightening today, and and that's the standards that he's got in the locker, that's the ability he's got. Uh, you know, and you know, if it's he it, it changed, he it, it, it changed the game when he came on, he really did. Uh, constant threat, uh, in behind, quality of delivery in the ball. And obviously, once he's by by playing in the 18 yard box, he's, he's, he's so hard to defend. Uh, Bobby came on. Uh, Bobby started the game and made his first appearance for Works Up Town since joining on loan from Doncaster uh, during the week. Um, so sort of two training sessions with us, but he slotted in quite nicely, didn't he? Yeah, I thought he had an ex excellent game. Um, kind of a baptism of fire in a way of what this level is about. You know, in in in. Uh, it's not, it's not just about having the ball, it's the physical side of it. And he's still a pup, he's still growing, and, and, and that's why he's with us, to, to learn that side of things and learn the physical side of it. And I thought he coped extremely well today. I thought, you know, the young man should be proud of his performance, we certainly are. Uh, and I thought he did extremely well. 11 points clear now, uh, obviously edging three for forward from Stockton. Um, it must be a pleasing aspect. I know it's too early to, to probably say, but yeah. it's, it's it's still a, an incredible fate at this stage. Yeah, look, we're, we're pleased to where we are. Why won't we be? Uh, I think any side would, would take our position at the minute in time in the league. But like I say every week, that these lads will not not get carried away. One, they're not the type of players in there to do that. And two, ultimately, I will not allow them. <coughs> I'll certainly not allow them to do it. It's three points. Another three points. There's so many twists and turns still to come in this league this year, and still extremely difficult places to go, and, and some difficult sides to face. So we're not getting carried away. Uh, I'm sure Stockton are not neither. It, it's just you know, it, it's just three points, and 
and I'm sure they'll be going away today, you know, still thinking they're chosen and, and rightly so. So let's 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 just take a game at a time. And finally, um, we take on Hemsworth on Tuesday night in the Sheffield and Hampshire Senior Cup. Uh, what are your thoughts going into that, and uh, will we see more of a rotator side? Um, obviously, they're going to be a difficult side. Uh, they've managed extremely well, uh, and a young side as well, uh, which is great to see. Uh, so I know it's going to be a difficult game, and they're extremely doing extremely well in the league. So um, you know it's going to be a very difficult game. Uh, I will make one or two changes, but it'll do not be many with the Christmas period coming up. We've got to keep focused and keep game times into into the lads. And also, I understand the the uh, what the what the trophy and the cup, the Sheffield Cup, means to the fans here. So we'll be taking it extremely seriously. And it's a game that we we desperately desperate to win and, and gain the next round.